Rainbird Arc Series controllers make it easy to connect to optional accessories like a rain or rain freeze sensor, master valve, or pump start relay. While the controllers do not need a rain or rain freeze sensor to operate, they can take the input from existing sensors and automatically pause your irrigation system in the event of rainfall. Rain sensors, by their nature, are reactive to rain events. This differs from Rainbird's proactive seasonal adjust, which automatically adjusts watering based on historical weather averages, yesterday's known weather, and tomorrow's weather forecast based on a local zip code. A rain freeze sensor can help conserve water, but is strictly supplemental. Be sure to check with your local and state regulations to determine if a rain or rain freeze sensor is required in your area. To connect a sensor, remove the yellow jumper wire from the SENS terminals on the controller. Then connect the two sensor wires to the SENS terminals. Remember, do not remove the yellow jumper wire unless you are installing a rain freeze sensor, as the controller will not function if this wire is removed and a sensor is not connected. Connecting a master valve or pump start relay is just as easy. First, using a direct burial cable, connect one of the wires from the master valve to the master valve terminal, marked M. Take caution that you do not route the master valve wires through the same opening as the power wires and do not connect more than one valve to the master valve terminal. Finally, connect the remaining wire from the master valve to the common terminal, marked C. A pump start relay connects to the controller in the same way as a master valve, but connects differently at the water source. Using a direct burial cable, connect one of the wires from the pump start relay to the master valve terminal, marked M. Connect the remaining wire from the pump start relay to the common terminal, marked C. Do not route the pump start relay wires through the same opening as the power wires. To avoid possible pump damage in the event run times are assigned to unused zones, connect a short jumper wire from all unused zone terminals to the nearest zone terminal in use. For additional installation and operation of a master valve or pump start relay, refer to the manufacturer's instructions.